All right, we back. We back. Undrafted opinions, man. Week 13. Week 13. Here with my co-host, man. You know what's going on. What's up, folks? What's up, man? Good to be back with you, man. Good to be back in effect. What's yeah, happening? man. Let's 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 talk about it. Let's talk about it, man. This this <coughs> another week of is your quarterback a leader or is he a bum? It's another week of that. Is your quarterback a leader or is he a bum? Week 13 edition. <coughs> is, he, is, he, is, he, is he Brock Purdy or is he Dak Prescott? Or is your man in a wheelchair like Joe Burrow in them? Or yeah. or can your, is your man's coming off a badass loss, nigga, like the motherfucking Lions? Right, right. You know what I'm saying? It's... It, it, it's, it's Every, it, it get critical, man. Every week in the motherfucking NFL, man. Bring your A game, man. Yeah, Bring your A, or your heart gonna get broke. It's a lot of QBs on the shelf right now, too. A lot of starters out, man. About eight, ten starters right mm -hmm. now. Or, or you just playing weak as fuck like Josh Allen and them. And the rest of them is garbage. Yeah. So let's jump in, man. The Chiefs and the motherfucking Green Bay Packers, man. What it do? Okay. Pa Pat Mahomes at eight and three. He go up against Jordan Love. You know what I mean? The Packers, they've been they've been okay, you know what I mean. But it's definitely a rebuilding season. The Chiefs' defense been soft all year. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. They're not keeping Patrick in the game. You know what I'm saying? It's it's they they got big Chris in them over there, but y'all ain't got no motion, bro. Y'all ain't got no motion, man. You know what I'm saying? They, they folding, man. Pat trying to put it together with these no name ass receivers. I don't know right. who the fuck these motherfuckers is. Right. Like last year, at least you had Juju and a couple of other motherfuckers. I don't know who the fuck he throwing the ball to besides Rice. Patrick and, don't know either. And that boy Rice, I don't think he related to Jerry Rice, but the, the the boy he really can't catch like that. You know what I mean? Nigga be fumbling shit, but you know and drops saying? is well documented. Yeah. In, in, anyway, it's just the Chiefs. I don't know if Andy Reid got the magic this year. You know, they've been saying all season, right, about how they feel like defensive players going hard on Pat. I mean, going soft on Patrick Mahomes, like since he the superstar of the league, they ain't touching him. They was touching that ass this weekend. OK, Green Bay was touching that ass. He was running around, nigga frustrated, nigga couldn't do them sidearm passes, them big ass motherfucking um, <coughs> them big ass linemen. They was on that ass, man. Big it's, ass lineman was on that ass. It's, but. it's hard to win the Super Bowl every season, right? In Pat's defense, right? It's hard to win. You've been in five years, went to what? Three Super Bowls already out of five years? It's hard to win three. It's hard to win the Super Bowl every year, right? And number one is five seasons, all them playoff games and all them Super Bowls. He's D never played a playoff D game on the road. Bro. Defenses was going to end up keying in on that yeah. ass eventually. Yeah. He, never, he never played a game, a playoff game on the road yet. Mm. He's never played a playoff game on every the road. Every game man. been at home? That's crazy. He's never played a game that. on the fucking road, <laughs> B. It's five years. This nigga been to all them Super Bowls and mm. all them playoff games. If you look at a, Mahomes, a Chiefs game with Patrick Mahomes in it, it's going to be in Kansas City. Mm. So it's very hard to do that and all this. Yeah. So we can give him a slight weight pass for that. It's time catching up with him. The game catching up with him and shit. But it's, it's very difficult to win every season and shit and be first every season and win the ball and go to the ball every season. So uh -huh. you got to say, especially when you keep it. changing players and shit, it ain't like he got the same players no. from three years no. ago. Yeah. He got no. a whole new roster, a whole new running back, a whole new everything, a scheme and all the shit. Every year, every year shit. they do that. Man, every year they do that. It's Kelsey Mahomes, Chris Jones and Andy Reid. Uh -huh. That's what the chiefs is and have been. Other than that, you motherfuckers is interchangeable and dispensable. Man, it, like I said, um, Mahomes and them, they got up. It's tough. It's tough, man. Mahomes and them couldn't do nothing early. You know what I mean? They were shut down. While, while Jordan Love, he got a little motion with this Watson, nigga. Like, uh, no, Jordan Love, been, he been coming on late in the season. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's like he trying to prove a point that him being the Aaron Rodgers savior, nigga, is not no Fugazi shit. He done sat behind that man for about five, six years. You know what I mean? This is time to show. It started off a little rough because they is like, what, five and six or some bullshit like that. Yeah. But these last couple of games, Jordan been showing his ass. You're right. You're he been right. showing his ass. He been, right. he been coming down. 
he been getting the ball to these receivers. I don't even know who the fuck these receivers is. I don't know who their name is or anything, back. but these niggas, he throwing the ball to these niggas and they catching it. Well, you know what well. I'm saying? So, so what he doing? He solidified his place as a starter. So he can remain a starter. Mm -hmm. You know, he proved that. I mean, go about 500, let's say, for a season. It's all right, whatever. Or, uh, 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 you know, fuck around, be wild card even. Oh, well, you know. And, cool. and just we'll to be it. honest, I think this whole Taylor Swift shit done fucked up Travis Blood. <laughs> blood. Nah, for real, Blood. I think it done fucked his head up. Cause so up that concentration, man. Yeah, he's he supposed man. to be on his kiddo shit. He ain't on none of that. You <laughs> <laughs> know what I mean? He ain't dancing in the end zone. I don't know. It's, it's looking bad. It's looking like Patrick is the only person that, that you that he you the only person that he throwing to. He ain't throwing to nobody else. He don't got trust in nobody else. So when you go up against that middle now and defense is keying in on you, them safeties and them linebackers busting that ass. Mm. Mm. And Travis ain't he can't mm. really do shit. When you got linebackers on you, usually he'll have a safety or a DB. He could kind of do his he dougie. Wiggle. Linebackers is crunching that ass, <laughs> man. They was crunching that ass. He ain't been doing nothing. He been lost, man. They, they, the, the Chiefs, I mean, the Green Bay D-line, they was manhandling the offensive line oh, yeah. for the motherfucking Chiefs, Chiefs man. man. It, it I'm was... telling you, bro, Pat did a little bit of magic to Pacheco to move the sticks to make the games close. But like I said, Jordan, I don't know if he been studying a, a boogie. I don't know if he been studying, right? But he do his little Dougie wait all the way to the end of the game, come down, drive the ball down, and get that field goal, man. Jordan, man, he been looking. He, he he been he been looking good, man. That's he done took do. some pages out that book. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying. You so learn something. He soaked up something. Yeah, Same man. Like All I right. said, like I said, man. And then um, um, Owens gave. Mm. Th 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 that's this is what I wanted to say earlier about Owens. He gave Mahomes a little shoulder out of bounds, like an ugly little nasty one, nigga. Like nigga. Tapped him. And 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 it took the little wind out his little. You know what I mean, little bird chest. Took it, took to win out his little bird chest, and 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 that just goes to show, man. Once motherfuckers start talking, the league was already saying all the sportscasters, the Mahomes can't get touched. Don't nobody want to tell you that ass got touched. Mm -hmm. Talking about the wind took mm -hmm. out his ass, two hundred million dollars. Yeah, nigga, yeah. you could get touched, nigga. Just like these niggas yeah. in the streets, nigga, you could get touched. Man, you so, lost a few of them Sonic rings, huh? Chiefs, Chiefs lose again, man. Mahomes is humbled again. He humbled again, man. You off that pedestal. You know what I mean? They was trying to throw you into that Brady. You know what I mean? Montana. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. So we get it together, Andy Reid. Let's do a little bit of quarterback whispering and hopefully it'll get together. But Chiefs, hey, y'all is not at the top of y'all game. Maybe you have to play a playoff game on the road this year. <laughs> fucking boo, fucking who. God damn it. Uh -huh. So sad. Shit. Man. I'm we'll moving see. on. To the motherfucking Eagles and the 49ers. What can you say, man? Man, what can you say? Good the, game, good game. First thing I want to say these million dollar niggas, they came to the game in all black, black on black <laughs> Air Force Ones. All black on black Air Force Ones. And don't, don't, and don't, don't, don't forget that Debo been on all the podcasts. Saying Bradbury and them is trash. Like they scared to tackle him, can't fuck with him. That's what Debo been talking. He said, you know, I respect, no. he said, I respect Slay. You know what I mean? A couple of other niggas over there. But that secondary, he said, I'm going to torch their motherfucking ass. He said that to LaShawn McCoy on the podcast. So um, that, that just to let you know what type of time Debo was on. You know what I mean? And he said, I, I owe y'all something from that playoffs. Nigga, we didn't have no quarterback. So I owe y'all something. It's so what type of time the Niners was on. But, yeah, man. So, you know exactly what type of time they was on, man. If you think Jalen was Superman, the 49ers defense was kryptonite, man, on motherfucking Sunday, man, okay? Man, that's what, that's what I like the most, man. The D did a good job, man. 19 D did points, a, man. D did a great job. We, 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 we really didn't know what to expect now that the Uso went out. You know what I mean? We didn't right, know what was right. going on. But ever since Trevarius and them, been, uh, since the uh, motherfucking Thanksgiving, niggas been eating barbecue turkey. Okay, niggas been eating. They been man, like I, I was talking shit. You know what I mean? Cause Javarius wasn't proven. Nigga didn't really know who he was. That country ass nigga been out there, nigga balling, nigga 
balling, locking niggas down, nigga, like a master lock. I've been checking him. I said, yeah, look at yeah. him. Look at him. I said, the boy is nice. And let's get rid of the elephant in the room right now. Swift got his motherfucking snot bubbles run. You seen that shit. My nigga Lenore, that's why I said these these, these yeah, niggas ever. Name, listen, ever since the motherfucking um, the, the Topanga went down, these niggas been out there balling. Lenore out there balling, bro. These niggas done stepped up. I didn't think they was going to step up like that. But they got a good team. They rally behind chasing them and boasting them. They give good motivational speeches. What's the name? Um, My one nigga... The, the predator that nigga gave mm. a motherfucking speech so good the other day, nigga. I mm. wanted to play. Mm. Man, nigga, I'm sitting hit. at home like nigga Real Albert, Real nigga, Real getting me, getting me going, nigga. Yeah. Albert, get me going, nigga. So I said, Fuck. It, it, it really was over for the birds, man. For they even yeah, got started, yeah, man. Yeah, it was yeah. over for the birds, man. They tried to get a little bit of, you know what I mean, some going, but AJ and them just couldn't do nothing. Greenlaw out there poking coaches mm. and shit all in the nose and shit. Like, they was bullying niggas from the gates, man. And I just they think that... Through them, through them, I, and through and, them, and, them, and I just think that that's, that's a motto for the Niners. When they not on that type of time, then, then, then they not as good as they, they really need to be. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When, 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 when Purdy and them is kind of like stuttering and shit, they not on their A game. But when everybody is on their A game, they better than the Eagles, man. They yeah. better than the Eagles because I mean, you, 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 nice. you just seen AJ and Devontae them was lost, bro. Yeah. And, and these ain't no top corners out there. These is filling in niggas. Yeah. They locking shit up. I think that, that say a lot about motherfuckers that want to play for Shanahan. Motherfuckers want to play. He a good coach. No matter what defense um, coach he plug in there, it's, it's, it's good. That was, it's that was good. the key, man. That was the key. It seemed like it might have been a focus this week. <clears throat> where you just uh, want to tighten up the coverage, man, and have just have guys focus on on uh, the passing game and, and coverage and shit like that, mm -hmm. scheming that up, switching that around, fucking with them. So that was that was a good look, man. That was the most impressive part, man. Piece mm -hmm. of the game was that. And, and let me just aspect, say, D Debo is a lot to tackle, blood. Debo is a lot to tackle, blood. No, for I mean, he is a lot to motherfucking tackle. I be seeing man, these niggas running out of his legs and all type of shit. They can't do nothing with him. They don't phase nothing the kid. And then hold on, just imagine trying to do that all game and then chasing, then have to chase McCaffrey after two or three plays. Top speed. Then you have to run full speed. And then oh, and then let me get back into Purdy, man. This nigga, bro, he spreads the motherfucking ball around. That's what he, he do. He spreads the ball. I even see you seen Jennings get some more. Jennings ain't had no motions in about three months. Like, for real, Jennings was having motion. That's what I'm yeah. saying, bro. Yeah. Like, Purdy, man, Purdy is proven, bro. Crazy, Purdy is proven he like an old school. You got to start him up. Get him warmed up, but then when he get warmed up, nigga, it's all gravy. Nigga, good like grandma's gumbo. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, um, shout out to the Niners, you know what I mean, for taking their stake you know, in the we, NFC. We know we know, this game don't mean shit, though. It's, 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 still it, it was an emotional win, though. It was big it was time, emotional, big time for, the, for the squad, for the team. And emotional going into the playoffs, you know mm -hmm. what I mean, get that mm -hmm. momentum. Because with them, with them three, four losses, you know, it might get a wild card. So you gotta have that momentum where niggas ain't scared to play us. Right. Niggas scared to play. Right. Feel me? So right. yeah, it's, it was, it's interesting, man. And it's, mm -hmm. it's, good. it's gonna be good to see how this shit turn out. Cause Philly got Dallas now. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we gonna see, man. We gonna see. You know, mm -hmm. we got the Hawks coming up, and then they got the uh, Cowboys. So it's gonna be nice, man. You got moving forward, bro. It's gonna be big. Yeah, hey, let's see. Big. NFC is lit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so moving on, we're going to talk about the um, the college playoff system and what happened over this motherfucking weekend. Because um, fucking Alabama stunned the world. Alabama stunned the world again. But this is this is always what goes on in the SSC between these two teams. I feel like they play, you know, um, seesaw with who takes it every year. Georgia and Alabama, they do this shit every year. And whatever they do, they fuck the whole playoff roster college all this shit they fuck that shit up blood they fuck it up every time and they make it bad for these little teams yeah that ain't been there that much they make yeah. it bad for them yeah they and get they, in this shit and they show out it's so they go bad so florida state was the fourth team to go 12 and 0 and they got snubbed man what you think about them getting snubbed I, well <laughs> <coughs> it don't it don't you know it don't seem like for the uh for the squad, man, for the kids, like, 
that it's that it's cool that that's how it should be that it should work this way. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I mean. No, it's, four it's best, bad. The it's four bad, best, man. the four it's best bad. teams, though. It is and bad. the four best teams, and I want you to be it's honest bad. with yourself. Is Florida State one of the best teams in the in the in the in the whole shit? Is he is they top four? Don't no, go, don't no, don't no, just no. go off their record. Yeah, but yes, yeah, don't just go off their record because right, right, they right. done had three quarterbacks. You know what I'm saying? Right, so they the quarterback is the they, one of their no, quarterbacks they, is on crutches. The, the the white boy they had number eleven, that nigga played a weak ass game last game. You know what I mean? So did did this team and this quarterback leading them in that they really deserve to be at that fourth spot? But yeah, over yeah, Texas, I could, I could over, over Texas, Texas because not you could over have Bama te- third. Mm. You could have Bama third and then put Texas fourth. I mean, uh, then put, where put Michigan Florida gonna State go? Fourth. Then where Michigan gonna go? No, it's go. You go Michigan. Um, Washington, Bama, Florida State. Wow, that would have been nice, but shit. Wow, that's, so that's, you just that's, taking that's, Texas out the it's game? It's like because they lost to Oklahoma, bro. They lost to Oklahoma. Texas lost to Oklahoma, and so Florida State didn't lose, man. But and Bama lost to Texas, but like that's what I'm saying. Like Bama lost to Texas and Oklahoma. Texas lost to Oklahoma. So, I, I know they lost to you know Oklahoma, but that beating Alabama was a big game, though, for them. That was a big win for them. That was a big SSC win. Yeah. You know what I mean? They 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 in the Big Twelve, whatever the fuck they in, nigga. They they don't, they ain't used to that. They ain't used to that. That was a. Yeah. They probably ain't did that, nigga, since um nigga Ricky Williams. Yeah, that, but them losing to Oklahoma is worse than Bama. That's why it's cool. Bama lost to Texas, man. What if Bama a, lost to Oklahoma or you know? That's no. <laughs> no, you can't you lost the So all undefeated is supposed to go in. That's that's how you feel. All undefeated is supposed to go in. No that's what happened last season, no matter, right? But, this but is what you want to do. Everybody you quarter, be nice. Everybody quarterback was healthy going in though. That's true. You right. Like these, I'm telling you. You still what, see like, what happened. You still see what's the outcome what, what, last season. Well, when Georgia even, took the shit. What the even, fuck? Even though the outcome is the outcome, Georgia is gonna play. Motherfucking Florida State anyway. Florida gonna, State anyway. Yes. The Orange Bowl. So we gonna say that. that's that's gonna be Let's like that. We gonna see if if motherfucking Florida State with this old put together ass team is even gonna make some noise. I predict sixty five to one. seven once man, again. In the Orange Bowl. I, I, I predict that too. I predict that too. And like, it's gonna come make, on, man. What you? What let, me, let me tell that, that you, man. You, listen. You let, be, let me, man. Let me that's tell you. Let me see it play out. Let me tell you what type of time white folks be on. White folks be on the type of time, nigga. They talking about. Florida State finna sue the labor board, finna sue the NCAA for insufficient, it ain't fair, and why we... Man, eat that L, man, and get over it, man. You know you still get a bag for a bowl game. Just because you didn't go to the championship, nigga, y'all didn't deserve that, nigga. Y'all fired y'all coach, nigga, in the middle of the season and hella shit, or he resigned or whatever the fuck y'all made him do. You know what I mean? So, like I said, with the no coach, no quarterback, you know what I mean, a couple of other players on the sideline that star players... Why the fuck would y'all be in the motherfucking college football playoffs? Why? I don't think y'all deserve it, Florida State. Even no, if y'all, no. even if y'all had Dion as y'all coach and y'all had the same fucking record y'all got now, and y'all did the shit y'all did, yeah, yeah, man, yeah. it'd be the same shit, yeah. bro. It'd be the same shit. Y'all just don't yeah. deserve it. That coach, nigga, he just been a coach head coach, nigga, for two weeks. Y'all That's don't cool, deserve man. it, champ. Y'all don't deserve it. Maybe next yeah, year man. y'all gonna get that bid, but y'all don't deserve it, bro. Come you know what I mean? Man, and then let's say Nick, man. Come on, man. Yeah, let's let's speak on Dion a little bit. What what you think is the future for Dion, man? Do he need to just clean house and get all the skeletons out? Or, like we were saying before, is the kids making it hard for players to play on their team when they mediocre? Because when you look at it and you put it in a picture in a frame, everybody on the team look mediocre to the to the Suns, man. You got you got you got little Dion Jr. nigga walking around with the camera. All he's shooting is Shador and Shiloh and Pops. You know what I mean? Like, I guess my question to you is: Should niggas feel some type of way about that, or should your head just be, "I'm a part of a team that these that's their personality." You know what I mean? But these my brothers, so I'm still gonna block. Niggas is like, man, this nigga showing watches and shit to all this nigga on TV, NIL deals, nigga, four million dollars. I ain't blocking for this nigga. Ooh. Is that is that a crazy attitude that's, to have? If that's an attitude, then you can go play somewhere else. That's a good thing about the portal, then. Mm-hmm. 
If that's how you feel, you feel like, oh, well, at the beginning it was cool, I made the squad, it's gonna work out, I'm gonna do what I do. But then it turned out to like something you don't like, and then this is what happened. Mm -hmm. If that's the case that happened, that went down, then uh, yeah, man, the portal is for you. Then let's, you should do it. Fuck around. That's and the, and, 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 and the portal, anywhere, do, any university, any squad. The portal do work for some niggas sure. too. The portal do work. You know what I mean? Maybe you didn't have no motion here. You could have some motion there. You know. I, that, I, that's I, another thing about that's good about the port is uh, you can reevaluate your squad and fuck around with your squad every season now. Like and, and, you know, and you recruit and have your classes and, and make it work. Like this is really how it's been going. But now it's just more like. You could just switch it up now and switch the players and have them instantly instead of like developing and having a plan or something. You just have. I, it I know. I know that. I know this. It happened a lot. Down. It happened a lot with Alabama players. You notice you be seeing a lot of Alabama players. They be like mm -hmm. he was like mm -hmm. maybe a fourth string running right, back right. or a third yeah. string running back. Yeah. They'll go to another team yeah. in another division. Yeah, They'll yeah, be yeah, killing. Coach now, coaches could just reevaluate their roster every season. But and then you redo their roster every season. But now. then you know it's a money thing too now because we was watching um, the Nebraska coach. He said, "Yeah, man, it's sad to say that a good um, quarterback right now going to cost about five million dollars. Hey. About five million dollars. Rebuilding your squad. Y'all been you're rebuilding your squad every season, and that's what y'all been robbing them five kids for years. Year, y'all been robbing them kids for years. Nigga, it's yeah. about time they got that yeah, money five, before they got yeah. to the league." It's about time. Imagine how much money these fat cats that's been sponsoring the um the NCAA and all these bowl games. Imagine how much money they've been getting all over these years. Trillions of dollars, nigga. So, nigga, let them kids eat. Nigga, yeah, I'm happy yeah, for them. It. I'm happy. But I, you know what they is mad about? You know who most of the NIL deals going to? It's the black players. <laughs> it's the black players. The white players, ain't, can't, they can't get no Lamborghini wow. deal. I'm sorry, son. Can't get no Lamborghini deal. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, um, and, and, and it's fucked up, too, because it's, it's really, like, kind of racial. Because all the NIL deals is to the black players. It ain't no Samoans. That's you know I mean? It ain't no well, Asians. What it people want to spend their money on? The talent. That's what they want to see. The talent. They want to spend their money on the talent, nigga. They know who the talent is. So Lamborghini, Mercedes, Cadillac, nigga. And I'm talking about um Fruity Pebbles, Kentucky Fried Chicken. They finna pay the talent, nigga. Not the help. Yeah. Cause they know shit what the niggas is worth, man. Yeah, shit. man. So we here, man. Um, switching on over to the NBA a little bit. A few things happen. You know what I mean? Um, what what you think about Yadoka? First, first, let's just say let's stay let's let's speak on Yadoka and people like him. Now, with LeBron being at this old tender age that he at, you know, a lot of these coaches that's in the league is niggas that he was dogging nigga when he was a young nigga. No, for real. I'm not talking about like, like just beating them, you know, casually like he do now. Maybe giving a nigga a handshake, taking a picture with their kids after the game. When LeBron was like 23, 24, LeBron was dunking on everything, dogging everybody in the league, we especially this. weak we ass niggas this. like Yadoka, especially it, niggas like him eating niggas up. So with that being said. LeBron doing his same thing like he always do, nigga. Twentieth year, twenty second year in the league, all this shit. You know what I mean? Yadoka, Yadoka starts calling him a bitch. You a bitch? Stop bitching! Stop bitching! Stop bitching! You know the, the the gentleman that LeBron is. He walk up. You know what I mean? Player style. <laughs> hey, bro. Like you got to you got to watch that. Don't be using yeah. that that loose yeah. man, champ. He said, "What you gonna do to me, soft ass boy? Come on, for real." Nigga, you the instantly. you the coach. You the coach, though, champ. You got that emotional? I'm watching niggas on the internet all in the comments. Yadoka stood on business. He, that nigga didn't stand on no business, nigga. They lost. Nigga, Dylan Brooks, nigga, didn't do no dances, nigga, or scored nothing. Nigga, Fred Van Vliet, nigga, is can is soup. Nigga, come on, bro. Yeah. Stop, nigga. Stop. I, I don't know what's going on. What you think about the one, dog? Man, no, man. fuck no. Like, you can't, you can't be doing that shit, man. Dude just hot. And he did, and he knows this too in his mind already. He already lived. So this is your boy. This is your, that's what your man's do, boy. Like, and LeBron ain't stopping. He said, "Cause you imagine like year after year after year getting beat and getting smacked and getting beat <laughs> there for twenty seasons, man. Twenty year half your life every time. Man, all these games and game. Now you all right? I can't. I ain't playing. I'm out. I'm coaching now. And you think you winning? You learning the shit? You doing your thing? And still, you coaching? And now you the head coach? And look, this shit's still going on. This the, nigga's still going on, man. Fuck, this shit is still going part, on. The, it's the, still happening. The, the fucked up part is that 
You you really can't do nothing. Now like, you got your boys. Now you got your young niggas and your wolves. You try to get your wolves to stop him. <laughs> DM up. You can't even tell niggas what to do to stop him now. Like, bro, you can't. It's do not nothing, working. Anything bro. you do is work. It's not working, man. Everything you try. You got. You got. So it's think like you just want to. The worst like, part though is that you got to think it's so many players that he just beat their ass to a pulp, and then maybe he didn't even make the finals. Right. Or maybe right, he didn't right. even. You know what I mean? Got to the finals and lost or some shit like that. Because he's been to the finals a lot of times. But he had to beat a lot of niggas mm -hmm. up to get mm -hmm. there. Hunt, all Imagine Hunt, all Hunt. these niggas that he beat up to get there that feel like LeBron was in my way of a championship. <laughs> no, for right. real. It's a lot right. of niggas that, most, lot of niggas that 20, feel like that. Years. Every... Generations of niggas that feel like that. He playing with niggas' sons right now. Like how, like, like you gotta think it's like time, it's niggas like it's Kmart and niggas like like Demar Derozan and you know what I mean? Niggas, niggas was babies. Nigga, LeBron, they was coming to LeBron camp. That's how OG he is. So your deck, your, your Doka, nigga, you out of pocket, nigga. You out of pocket, my nigga. Yes, bro. You That's out of pocket, smooth, my man. nigga. That's like, come smooth. on, bro. I, I, what, what one of the sports casters said, he said, nigga, you just showed the reason why you in weak ass, nigga, Houston anyway. That's what we doing. They just this showed you. Doing. They just showed you that, nigga, why, This, this nigga. what it is. Come on, Man. coach. This what it is, coach. This mm. how it go. So switching up, sw nigga. switching up a little bit. What you think about Mark Cuban, nigga, selling his stake in the, in the, in the, in the, um, the Mavericks? I mean, yeah, I mean, Luca is worth all this money, all these assets. And Kyrie, do you think? Let me. This is the question I want to ask you. Do you think Kyrie made him the kind of player that Kyrie has made him be like? I don't want the future of the NBA. You think that's what what made him feel like that? Because he ain't been really. I mean, you profit. You know what I mean. But he ain't really been grossing like you know, that because they ain't been winning. When he he OG, so he ready to just probably get his money and then get on, mm -hmm. right? Because he. It's Cuban. First from Cuban, it's, it's Cube. So he like, man, I'm trying to get on anyway. Fuck it, I'm OG. Uh, I'm good. Uh, that's probably one aspect. Another piece is they could probably make the franchise and take it to another level with Dallas and shit. Like him getting up out of there, getting his little piece. He's still fucking around, operating, but with that, his space frees up with that bring in. Could be some shit they use to elevate and get make it more profitable as a franchise. So... I, I I do oh. think I do think they do need something to switch up because Jason Kidd ain't it. I'm sorry, <laughs> Jason. No, Jason Kidd ain't it. Now now he he don't get us wrong. He right. made Adakapunko. He did. He made him. It's no question, no doubt about that. But you can't do it twice, nigga. You can't do it twice because nigga Kyrie and them niggas phony over there, nigga. They phony over there, bro. But but Luca is nice though, man. Luca is, is nice, but you know he raw, but it, Luca is it's just nice. Not working out. But is is he gonna be able to go one on one and duel with Steph Curry like that, like he did before? Is he gonna be able to do that again with Kyrie on the court? Cause you remember when he was dueling out with motherfucking Curry, they was going shot for shot, nigga, at one time. So I'm saying I don't think Luca gonna, Luca gonna have a space to do that, nigga. Playing with Kyrie, Kyrie want the ball. Kyrie want to dribble the ball. He want to shoot the ball. No, yeah, you're right. You're right. That's true. And, and That's I, what we've and, been seeing at least. They get. And just they with the kind of the shit, man. with the Stick kind of head shit. case that Kyrie is, I don't think Jason Kidd could corral that. You, I know you from Oakland, Jay, but you can't corral that. You can't. Kyrie is a whole different yeah, type yeah. of nigga, blood. Yeah, yeah. You know I mean, he an Indian reserve nigga, all type of shit. Yeah, nigga, man, what he got? Um, a nigga off brand shoes and all type of shit, man. He be praying before the game. He he got all type of shit er, going on, bro. Er, so on. I don't know if Kidd can handle all that, but. Mark said, I'm out. OG, <laughs> I'm out this motherfucker. Fuck y'all before y'all try to sue me for some yeah. racial shit or some shit or tell me my franchise is... Right. I'm out, nigga. Jordan, too. Niggas is Shoot out. Big niggas, big niggas, niggas boys is out. Boys, money, man. They's like, hey, let me just I, go I, ahead and get this paper real I already quick. followed my dream of being in the NBA. You know what I mean, coach? Nigga, fuck this shit. I'm done, nigga. <laughs> I'm done with this bullshit. Right, this money... The, la the last question is for your boy, man, the, 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 sp the splash dude. We're not going to call them their brothers because Clay is missing in action like where's Waldo and Jordan Poole is a motherfucking bum. So can Curry win MVP this year? Can he be on MVP status? If he, scores, if he scores 
35. If he scores 40 every game and they lose, what is that? What What does that mean? Like with the Rock, well, like with the Rockets, and we seen before with Harden. Like it's, he just comes now, prescribed with the weak team. Like he's like maybe he's the the uh, the Blazers now with Lillard with Dan. Mm. <laughs> so now, right? You had this nice shit, this kid, this famer, right? And then it's just bad. That's what mm. it could be. You know what I mean? So. Uh, in other cases, and, and, right and, and I was, season, I, was right say, I was saying Kaminga needed to step up. I seen him have one dunk, but what the fuck is two points, Kaminga? What the fuck is two points? Draymond is worth way more than that, and that's who you want to start over? Come on, blood! Like what the fuck? And then Moody and them. What the fuck is you niggas even? Well, they gotta get together. They gotta get together, bro. And this what it, and it shit like this make you and make you miss it. It make you miss Iguodala and motherfucking what's my nigga name with the fro? Eagle Dollar and, uh, uh, oh, uh, Livingston. Living, that's, uh, we missed man. them niggas, man. Them niggas that had no problem coming in playing defense, nigga. Hack a nigga or something, nigga, or do something to get some. These young niggas, I don't know, blood. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. man. Make some moves, get active or something, fuck around. Hey, but like I said, I give it to the Kings, Lakers, Clippers, Dubs. But it but should who, be Dubs who, but, and Clippers. Okay, so but give it's going to be bad if the Clippers go forth. Ooh, it's gonna be ugly. Yeah, so give but us, the give Dubs, us, Dubs could go third. Give us your three MVP, MVP in, in the MVP race right now. Who, who you feel like is in the MVP race? Uh, Jokic, mm-hmm. Doncic, always, Luka. always. I got Luca. I got, I got Luca too. I got Luca too. Uh, and uh, shit, right now, shit, your boy Tyrese Halliburton, man, do not forget. Patience, you know <laughs> that shit, that nigga. Patience, man. We got to give him a little shine, yeah, he man. He's looking that hot at least the last couple of weeks. Yeah, hey, hey, he was looking good. Maybe it's the attorney is giving the niggas the it's boost. A, it's some, it's, it's some, the attorney now. It's some bright light shining over we there talk, in Indiana, Who's man. been nice so far, like, in Christmas, before mm. Christmas in the league, right? Hey, so and, that's good for the season, for the and, league, man. And when you think about it, I think these tournaments is the highlight niggas and get niggas that little highlight a little bit. You yeah, know what yeah. I mean? So, Tyree, this is good. Dude. Albert man is going crazy, man. Right yeah, now, he man. is. He's going crazy. Looking, Watch out for him. Looking tough, man. Watch out for him. So, but know. yeah, man, undrafted, man. We here, man, every week, man. Come see us on Tuesday. We on Spotify. We on Amazon Music, man. We on YouTube, man. We on Instagram. We on Facebook, man. Where else we on? We on uh, Insta, Facebook. That's it. Talk, man. Yeah, man. We and, here, uh, we man. can get us on all the Apple uh, or any... Uh, any place you get your podcast. Anywhere where the lights is shining and it's fly motherfuckers flying around, man, we there, man. Undrafted, man. Tune in every week, man. We here, man. We out.